A bee swarm can be very scary, but with the bee population dwindling, one local beekeeper has an offer. Let him bring your bees onto his property for the winter. As News 13's Courtney Allen reports, he's actually collecting them with help from his neighbors. The bees are cool, and they're fun to work with, but they're under attack. Saving bees is Tim Janice's life work. I want to help him if I can. Since he became a beekeeper in the late 90s, he's noticed a steady decline in the bee population. It's been a real challenge because beekeepers are losing 20 to 25 percent of their bees a year. In his North Albuquerque Acres neighborhood, he says development, misinformation, and lack of water contributes to the bees' decline. Clean water, open space, you know, development doesn't let them have a lot of place to feed. That's why he reached out to his community in the spring to get people to report swarms to him instead of exterminators. More than a dozen people called. He now houses around 120,000 bees, more than doubling his hives. I went from two active hives back up to seven active hives, and I hope to get it up to 12. He's insulating the bees' hives to get them through the winter and thrive into the next season. I start feeding them with sugar water usually to nurture them and keep them here. People in the area say they're thankful for his efforts. I think it's super important because obviously bees are becoming extinct. We need more people like that that's willing to help save something that's so important to our environment. Janice says it's just all in a day's work. If we all work together, we can keep the bees, give them safe homes, and it benefits all of us. Courtney Allen, KRQE News 13. Janice hopes this becomes a yearly thing. Now, what is he doing with all the honey he collects? He's giving it to family, friends, and his neighbors.